This latest reckless experiment is what I call the light drum sequencer, as it uses light to sequence drums. When light passes through a hole in the disc, it shines on an array of phototransistors, which produce a trigger pulse on the output. This makes for a very visual way to sequence percussion. More holes can be easily added with an X-Acto knife, and unneeded holes can be removed with some opaque tape. The disc is driven by a motorized potentiometer, which I have removed the stop from, allowing it to spin continuously. I'm not using the potentiometer part, I just needed a motor with a reduction gear, and this one was the most convenient. Speed of the motor is controlled by varying the voltage with the power supply. The motor is rated for 5 volts, but can be used with twice that for short periods of time. Now let's look at the circuit that produces the trigger pulse. Light shines on the phototransistor, which pulls the negative input of the op-amp near ground. With the positive input used for feedback, the op-amp will saturate its output, producing a pulse with nice clean edges. The final part is a gate to trigger circuit. This keeps the pulse produced to about 5 milliseconds, perfect for triggering a drum sound. Using all four channels of the op-amp, the complete circuit looks like this. For anyone interested in making one of these for yourself, I have a link in the description for a PDF of the disc so you can print out your own. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.